Hey, this is Time Bomb, and if it's your first time checking out the channel, hit that subscribe button to catch all the updates. Thanks a lot for joining me here today. I'm going to do a breakdown on a play that helps you bring pressure against some of these quarterbacks before they can really get outside on you. So we're going to take a look here at the nickel normal. This is a play that, you know, it's been popular over the years, and I think it's, it's always good. We're going to take a look at it here. The nickel blitz two. Let's see what it got. Random. Okay. Random going to be a little bit weird, so we'll see what we come up against here. So what I want to do is blitz both of these linebackers, but I want to get, see the slot? The slot back here, I want to get him right here. Our nickel back, we need him right close to the line, and we're going to put contain blitzes on by hitting both of the bumpers on Xbox. Xbox. And uh, then this other guy, we're going to get him right in here. So, uh, see, this is the one thing that sometimes I have problems with in practice mode. It doesn't put this guy on the... Uh, he puts him on the contain rather than this guy on the contain. Because you want the man who's outside. You want them on the outside on the contains. And then I just use my safety and kind of get in a little bit closer here. And then so you've basically got a bunch of guys flying in. So if he tries to get outside, then you should be able to get him before then. And then before any throws can get made, those guys are coming right at him. So this is a great little blitz here I like to mix in. I don't like to use it exclusively like all the time. But, you know, I like to get in, put it in here or there. Keep my opponent on their toes. There we go. See, he's got the contain blitz on the outside. Like I said, you can get you can both your safeties. You can get them into the box or one of them here. And then you got them in close here. Get him on a random offensive play so we don't know what he's going to do against us. He does get the throw off. And you got to kind of dive in there very quick. Dive in there. you got to get in there, real, fly in there really quickly, make a play if they do get those check downs. But other than that, you're kind of hoping for uh, the pressure to get in before he can really make a throw. You can sacrifice one of these blitzing guys. I don't think it should be either guy on the... You got on my, ooh, what did I do there? Interesting. I don't know what happened there. He chose that that line that uh, linebacker chose to go over the lineup in that side. So I'm gonna let him do it. I'm gonna let him do it. As soon as he wants that's the approach he wants to take, I'll give it to him. He flies in there and gets the sack. So just shows this play. You know, you just get pressure in there really quickly. I think even if they do get a quick throw off, you should have guys there ready to make a play. There we go. Again, see, I'm not getting that set up with him. There we go. Now he's on the contain blitzes. So you got seven guys flying in here. It's another time when you just send in seven, have a decent user, a little couple squats, and uh, a little deep blue. Before you can do anything, play action is going to get shut down. You're going to be able to make a play on him and get lots of stops. So this is just a defense that I like to use. Let me know if it's working for you. If you're running any nickel normal, I find it's a great way to help, you know, like I said, stop those some of those mobile QBs from getting outside the pocket and as well just bringing pressure. So thanks a lot for checking out this video. Hit that like button. I'm Time Bomb. You guys are awesome. And I'll catch you later. A boom, boom.